the Navy announced plans April 8th to deploy the Laser Weapon System, or LAWS, to the 5th Fleet Area of Responsibility on board USS Ponce beginning in fiscal year 2014. This technology is really important to the fleet so that what we can do is make uh, the cost of delivering fire to an enemy affordable and to relieve ourselves of the need to rearm. Um, having a magazine that is essentially endless because we can generate power as long as we've got generators able to be fueled um, gives us until the end of our fuel supply the ability to generate energetic fires against an enemy, whether that's defensive or offensive. Laws provide ships with a scalable weapon system for use against unmanned aerial vehicles and small fast attack boats. The laser system has the ability to be used as a non-lethal deterrent to dazzle enemy sensors and to immobilize or destroy enemy targets. This provides commanders with a multi-tiered threat response from one system. After a successful at-sea test period aboard USS Dewey, where law successfully engaged and destroyed three moving targets, the system will be more fully integrated into USS Ponce for its fiscal year 2014 deployment. Now we want to make sure that it can be integrated fully. The power grid, the cooling grid, the location of the weapon system. Right now for the Ponce, we've already walked all that. We've walked the ship itself. That is all very achievable. There's no hurdles that we don't, uh, we, we can't get through right now. Uh, so to us, that's the piece that we want to just prove out with the Ponce. And my colleague Admiral Eccles will talk about that. Uh, but again, we feel very confident on everything we've done thus far that it will prove out very successful. From the Defense Media Activity, I'm Petty Officer Joshua Shepard.